I'm Cindy from Startup World Tech and we are doing a co-interview with Aving News from Korea on the K Startups this year at Switch2022. So the Switch uh, event is actually the Singapore Week of Innovation and Technology and we are going to interview some startups that are going to be telling us more about their business models. So right now we have a global events and the invited guests are seated over here to listen to the various different innovations. And now we are at the Korean, South Korean Pavilion. So we are going to interview some of the companies that are going to offer new business ideas. So right now we have with us um, Rachel from Mesa. <laughs> Hi, my name is Rachel, Rachel Sumi Cho. Uh, I'm the Chief Business Officer at Mesa and I'm pleased to um, meet you guys and able to introduce Mesa to you guys. Um, start with the first question? Yes. Um, yep. Okay, um, can you tell us more about your company? Sure, uh, Mesa is a construction technology company. We're aiming to build this technology towards a digital twin. Okay, so maybe you tell us what's the objective of your company? Uh, we're heading towards a real-time thinking from the off offline site to the digital space in the real-time based. So which kind of industry is it suitable for? For now, we have built our success cases in construction industry. We started from Korea and we're expanding over to the globe. And we also expand to uh, mining, oil and gas, agriculture, um, and maritime. Okay, I see. So what kind of technology is involved in um, your business model to be able to do digital monitoring successfully? Uh, there are three technologies that we are uh, deploying. One is 3D uh, reconstruction, two is georeferencing, and the three is computer vision. And underlying technology is a computer vision. So we are uh, u utilizing all these technologies to uh, develop the software. Okay, okay. So what kind of benefits does it bring for the company? What does it do for the company? Uh, there are a couple of benefits, but just to say a few, one is about you can save your time and energy to physically visit to the construction site um, so that you can remotely manage the multiple projects at the same time. Secondly, uh, the second benefit is the safety management. So you have your phone, you download an app, and the workforce at the site is automatically connected to the platform that will give you an access to see the movement of the workforce at the site so you can prevent injuries or accidents by having MESA. Okay, I see. So um, in future, what kind of uh, plans does your company has? Well, um, you know we always aim high. We see the beyond the horizon. So at the end of the day, we're aiming to achieve the complete digital twin, which means you are completely reflecting um, the reality and then you're putting that into the digital space. So we're aiming towards a digital twin. And will we be able to see a digital monitor our sites in real time? Yes, the time is coming, but there are challenges that we have to solve. So for instance, uh, there are uh, different types of data. Because of the types of data, we need to streamline the type of data into one so that it's comparable. And secondly, we also have to put a conscious attention to actually improve the quality of the data so that we pull the insights out of the results. So those are the challenges that we have to overcome to achieve the vision that we have. Okay, so can you share with us the whole process of the data collection? Yes, of course. Uh, there are three steps involved. Number one is that you collect data from drones uh, through uh, the application where you can input the conditions of altitude um, and flame, uh, filming superposition. And then the data will automatically get uploaded to the platform once you collect the data and the data is automatically going into the engine, it processes the data and at the end what happens is you can see all the applications as a result. You can access the applications in the platform so that you can use the software results. Yes, I think he needs... 
baseball. Yeah, I think he needs a seat. Cross-sectional math, civil work calculations, BIM integration, real-time safety monitoring, and this is our future. So we aim to achieve to expand across in construction, land in cities, oil and gas, maritime, and agriculture. But that's our vision and the end picture of this company. Okay, one last question before I end. Does the company need a, a lot of investments into the equipment before they can get started? Well, that's a very good question. In fact, you do not need a very heavy investment. You only need commercial drone, per se DJI, uh, and any kind of commercial drones, as long as it has the feature of uh, phot photography. And it costs a very minimum. So in fact, the hurdle to start to use this technology is very uh, low. Thank you so much. You have a better understanding of your business already. Thank you so much, Rachel. Thank you. Bye. Bye.